single I bought, I Feel Free Cream. I think Crocodile Rock by Elton John. I didn't buy a single, I bought an album. It was Help by The Beatles. <music> Jimi Hendrix at the Seville in London. My first concert was Jimi Hendrix. Was Jay on the Isle of Wight, John, Andy and LD. PFM, the band in which I played. I couldn't live without my family. Digital performer and a computer to run it on. Uh, music and family. <laughs> Two things. Wow, uh, what question would I like to have been asked that I've never been asked? <laughs> oh, just why? Why, Mark? Which is the capital town of Kamchatka. Why are you so crap? I would be a photographer or, no, you know what I would be is that I would be a, a religious leader because I in fact have my church and I would lead all of you onto a higher place if I wasn't held back by this rock music which holds me to the earth. In fact, I think I might allow myself to rise even today and to bring you with me because that's what I'm here for, to take you closer to the upstairs place. In fact, to hell with all this music. Let's you and I join hands, join our hearts together so that we may rise and accomplish our greater mission here on the planet. And it only costs you 10 bucks. I absolutely don't know. Maybe, uh, uh, what's English for? Uh, with wood, working with wood, I like. Uh, I could do a few things, you know, uh, I'm, I wouldn't starve. Uh, you know, if I wasn't a musician, but it, it's kind of unthinkable anyway because it's all I've ever known I wanted to do. Um, you know, which and that's a real blessing. If you have a direction in life, you, you know what you're going to focus on. Things like if you're not so good at school, it's not actually the end of the world because this career is waiting for you around the corner. Because I was pretty dumb at school, I have to say. But if I hadn't been a musician, I, I'm quite handy, you know, I, I can build, I built a barn for myself, a big old six meters high, 15 meters long. And, six meters deep barn out of poles, which I really enjoyed doing. I had tractors. So I maybe some of my ancestors are farmers and my you know relations, so maybe I could have been a farmer. I decided to be a professional musician at the age of nine. Well, music instruments were thrust into my hands from a very, very early age. I didn't quite know why until I was twelve and I was playing in the Black Knights at the American Embassy Beach Club, and I'm playing my first gig with my band, playing We Gotta Get Out of This Place, and Janet McRoberts, who's like 15, is dancing, to, and that's like, when I'm 12, this mountain, this woman, this woman, is just like, I couldn't even dream about, there she is dancing to my thing. And I'm the skinny little runt, you know, I was a late developer, pale-faced little kid, but the drums turned me into a silverback monster! And so, that was, I suppose, the reason why I became a musician. The real reason was Janet McRoberts dancing. She did that to me. It happened, but I think when I was 20, that PFM grabbed me from school. Mm -hmm.